The Gospel of today's Mass is taken from the Gospel of John, chapter 6, and it's five short verses. But I think there's there's a wonderful reassurance that's given to us in, in this Gospel passage. The wind was strong and the sea was getting rough. The disciples had rowed three or four miles when they saw Jesus walking on the lake and coming towards the boat. So they're in the midst of a stormy situation. They are rowing three or four miles. It's probably taken them a couple of hours. They're probably exhausted. And the wind is against them. The waves are against them. It's all a very threatening situation. And then Jesus comes to them, walking on the water. Jesus is walking on the very water that threatens them. He's walking upon the problem. The problem is beneath his feet. And in this, this gospel scene, we're reminded of Jesus' absolute dominion. He is Lord. They are exhausted. They are frightened. And they are in need. And how often are we in that same circumstance? Storm going on around us, storm going on within us. Obstacles, trials, tribulations, just things not going right. Everything going against us. And this gospel reminds us that in those storms, the Lord walks upon them. The Lord walks with us through that storm. And the Lord, most importantly, walks towards us and he speaks. It is I, do not be afraid. The wind was strong, the sea was getting rough, but the Lord walked upon the sea. In any difficulty or trial in our life, let us always remember, Jesus is Lord. All things are beneath his feet, and we ourselves are beneath the protection of his hand. So we can take seriously his invitation. It is I. I'm with you in this. Do not be afraid. The very thing that threatens them, he walks upon it. The very thing that threatens you. He's got it. He is Lord of all things. And in your trial, ask yourself, in any trial, ask this question. In this present difficulty, is Jesus Christ still Lord? Of course he is. And he says to you and he says to me, it is I. Do not be afraid.